How's it going guys? This is Spencer from 7CC Productions, also known as Lone Seeker 777 from 7CC Productions. I stopped saying that because it's just too many 7s in a row. Anyways, so what we are doing today is trying to fix the shadow flicker, the shadow flickers when using the Sonic Ethers, Unbelievable Shaders and other dynamic shadows and lighting mods. So, first thing we're going to do is and this is assuming you have both Minecraft Forge and Sonic Ethers Unbelievable Shaders already installed. So you're just going to want to move your way over to MinecraftForum.net and find Optifine. So once you're there, you want to click the mirror because it's easier to navigate than the download. It's still kind of difficult to navigate, so I'll show you through it. What do you mean the connection was reset? I'll reset your connection. Okay. This is a lie. This is irrelevant. That is completely irrelevant. So you just click here. And you click keep. If you're using Windows 7, you can have the convenience just to drag it on your desktop after auto unsnapping and resnapping. So now you're just gonna wanna go percent app data percent. Snap that over there. Go to Minecraft. And go to mods. You drag it, drop it in there. I already have it in there. Now, uh, one thing I forgot to mention before is do not immediately go with ultra. If you have a slow computer, well, actually, that's ridiculous. You're using uh, Sonic Ethers Unbelievable Shaders. Why would you have a slow computer? Okay, irrelevant question. There we go. Um, now I'm using a texture pack that's completely irrelevant to the issue. Okay, once you load it up, I've already put, I've already applied the fixes to the shadow. Uh, let's see, from here. You want to go to performance, and let me just check which one it was that caused the issue. No option. Huh? It's not doing it for me. Oh well. Okay. So uh, you're gonna want to change to multi-core if you have more than one core. Uh. You're going to want to navigate over to performance. You're going to want to turn preloaded chunks to 8. Lazy chunk loading on. It's not turning on for me. I broke it. I don't know. Okay. Uh, I'm not entirely sure what that one does. But it does something. So. Once you got that on, uh, try. Uh, okay, uh, yeah, you're gonna want to do this in the menu, so you don't have to deal with that issue. So y then you can go through and you can choose. I I I like clouds off because clouds are annoying. Trees. I like fancy trees. I like fancy water. Translucent blocks fancy. Dropped items, fancy. So on. I like fancy. Uh, I don't like rain at all, actually. Fancy grass. And there's also a uh, fancy snow, where. Uh, what? You can turn it up to. Freaking thirty-two now. And that is because of Optifine, just letting you know that. Okay, so once the once you put the basic uh, d uh, preloaded chunks and lazy chunk loading, that should solve your issue. You won't need to, you won't have to do anything else, but you can if you want. I don't know why those were turned down in the first place. I don't know why I'm still talking. Okay, so if this helped at all, and if you like the videos, and all that fun stuff, um, just send me a sub and be, be awesome. 
be awesome and sub. Ah! Uh, ah, uh, it froze! See? Oh, just excessive load time. It's only lagging because I'm recording, I promise. Okay. Now that that's done, see you guys later. <laughs> Sorry if my voice sounded weird, but my original uh, Turtle Beaches that I was using for recording finally broke, so see you guys later.